Buildings are responsible for nearly 40% of all carbon emissions. Around a quarter of those emissions are embodied carbon. And embodied carbon refers to the emissions associated with production of building materials, from raw material extractions to the manufacturing of finished products. And materials like steel and concrete create the most embodied carbon because they're the hardest to make and they're the hardest to transport. Cement, a component of concrete, accounts for nearly 10% of all worldwide emissions. Steel is nearly as carbon intensive as cement, but alternative materials have lower embodied energy. For example, the carbon footprint of timber or wood structures is as much as five times less than steel. Mass timber is a really sustainable product out in the marketplace right now. What it is, is it's gluing timber together and creating these big structural beams out of it. Mass timber actually sequesters carbon. It doesn't create carbon, and that's a huge advantage of the mass timber building. We specify more products than any other firm in the world, and we're creating green specifications, and that is we're specifying materials and furniture and building products that are sustainable. We're working with our partners, contractors and consultants, and structural engineers and mechanical engineers to reduce the footprint of our specifications. And we specify millions upon millions of square feet in our portfolio around the globe. So the leverage from this is tremendous and will make significant impact on climate change around the globe.